हेलो एवरीवन एंड वेलकम बैक टू अनदर डे ऑफ स्वतंत्र देश सेनानी विशेष वी ऑल नो अबाउट द ब्रेव हार्टेड शहीद भगत सिंह जी बट हैव वी एवर वंडर्ड हु वाज हिज इंस्पिरेशन मे बी नॉट सो हियर वी आर विद इंफॉर्मेशन अबाउट द पर्सन हु इंस्पायर्ड भगत सिंह जी एंड हुज फोटो ही यूज टू कैरी अराउंड इन हिज पॉकेट He got deeply inspired by the 19-year-old Shahid Kartar Singh Sarabha. Kartar was born on May 24, 1896 in Sarabha village of Ludhiana district, Punjab. He received his early education in Ludhiana itself. After passing the 9th standard, he went to his uncle in Orissa and passed the high school examination from there. After that, he went to America for his higher education. His association with Nalanda Club of Indian Students at Berkeley aroused his patriotic sentiments and he felt agitated about the discriminatory treatment meted to immigrants especially the Indian manual workers in the United States. In March 1913 Indian workers in the states of Oregon and Washington founded an organization to fight for their rights. Around the same time in May to June 1913 Lala Hardayal addressed a series of meetings in California which laid the foundation of a movement This movement was called the Ghadar movement and its intent was to call for an armed revolution Sarabha was quick to join the movement and contribute to it The Ghadar newspaper was initially published in Urdu language in November 1913 Sarabha worked hard to get it published in Punjabi language as well. Being politically well informed, the revolutionaries had sensed that Europe would soon be plunged into a state of war and thought it to be a golden moment to strike against the British officials. On 28 July 1914, much earlier than the Ghadarites expected, an armed confrontation escalated into the First World War. Sarabha Sarabha played an important role in motivating Indians living in America to return to home and fight against the oppressive British rule. The Ghadar issue published on August 4, 1914 motivated the Indians with the following words: "O oh warriors, this opportunity you have been looking for has arrived." By the end of October 1914, eight ships carrying Indian immigrants from the USA and Canada reached India among the returnees was Kartar Singh Sarabha who landed in Colombo and made his way to Punjab the plan was to ignite the indian soldiers in punjab to wage a mutiny against the british government in india but unfortunately things did not move as planned many who landed in calcutta were arrested on arrival Sarabha nevertheless continued undaunted and entered many cantonments in Punjab and attempted to radicalize the soldiers Vishnu Ganesh Pingli his associate from the US and Raj Bihari Bose from Bengal who had joined the Ghadarites in India were his companions in this endeavor The date for the planned armed revolt was set for 21st February 1915 This was however leaked to the british authorities after which the date was changed to 19 february 1915 meanwhile the british reacted swiftly and arrested a number of revolutionaries and the promised revolution did not materialize both pingli and saraba along with other associates got arrested during interrogation saraba stated bravely that it was his duty to organize and motivate Indians against the British rule Kartar Singh Sarabha and his associates were tried for the acts of sedition the kaiti and murder the court sentenced all 24 revolutionaries including Sarabha to death Kartar Singh Sarabha and six of his companions were hanged on November 16 1915 when he was hanged he was just 19 years old These brave sons of India swung on the gallows with smiles on their faces. That was how deep their love for their country was. Thank you.